So I've dressed Cardi B in Kiwi. I like to call her Cardi Kiwi. I have also dressed Jennifer Aniston in Apples, and I call her Jennifer Appleston. So I kind of like to work with puns a lot. One of my favorite creations is actually Billie Eilish, and I made her a green avocado outfit because, you know, she had green hair. People love when I dress Beyonce. I've dressed her several times. I made her a dress with mandarin oranges. Nicki Minaj, people request her all the time. Celine Dion, I said Celine Dijon, and I made her a whole dress out of Dijon mustard. So she reposted that on her TikTok account. Hi, my name is Ruby Perman and I play with food professionally. I'm a graphic designer turns food stylist and I take anything edible from fruits, vegetables, anything I can find in my kitchen and I play high fashion looks on celebrity faces. I'm from California, so my favorite season is award season. I just think that the celebrity gowns are like works of art. So when the pandemic happened and everything was canceled, including the Met Gala and the Oscar awards, I wanted to bring the red carpet into my kitchen. So I started styling celebrities with food. So I would just cut out a photo of a celebrity and I put them on a plate. And then I would just take whatever I have in the kitchen and make a fancy gown out of it and started a TikTok account. My first post was with Jennifer Lawrence and I styled her in a red pomegranate dress. Her top was the peel and her skirt was the pomegranate seeds. And I even gave her a pomegranate hat. And that first post went viral on TikTok. I think it has like over 2 million views right now. You know, I just wanted to give joy to people during these uh, challenging times. So my motto is when life gives you lemons, wear them. I think my inspirations could just come from produce shopping or what am I having for dinner tonight? I love when fans request different celebrities for me to dress. The video of Bad Bunny, that post, everyone has been commenting on it and I think it has like over 12 million views. So that one's definitely one of the fan favorites. The dress that I made for Ariana Grande, I recreated her big puffy tool dress and I used rice paper. And I love working with rice paper because you can actually color it with food coloring. So I did butterfly pea powder and that made the dress into a purple and I know her her favorite color is purple, so I wanted to make her something. And then I was able to scrunch up the rice paper and it made it look like a puffy cloud of tulle. So that's definitely one of my favorite creations. My TikTok videos are usually between 15 seconds to 60 seconds long. From my creating the actual plate, that probably takes me about two to three hours. And then from that to me editing the video, it probably takes me around three hours to six hours, depending on special effects or the, you know, the bling or the transitions that I'm gonna do for each video. So I get this question asked a lot, like what do you do with the food after you create it? and I eat them. I eat them with my family. I share them with my friends. Food brings people together. And I think that for me, creating a dish is really a labor of love. My intention is just to share love and joy with the people watching my videos during these challenging times. <laughs>